Today I'm going to install MySQL on Kubernetes using OpenEBS container attached storage. So the first thing that we're going to want to do is install OpenEBS. We can do this via Helm. Now that OpenEBS is installed, the next thing we need to do is set up the C store pool. There's an example YAML file in the OpenEBS documentation about how to do this. So we're going to go ahead and use this today. And next we need to set up the storage class. Once again, there's an example in the documentation, so we'll just go ahead and use it. And with both of those deployed, we can now install MySQL. What we're going to want to do next is connect our Kubernetes cluster up to Maya Online. So if you go to mayaonline.io and log in with your Google credentials, I'm sorry, your GitHub credentials, and then on the left hand side you'll see the word clusters. So you want to go ahead and click clusters and then click connect a new cluster in the upper right hand side and then give your cluster a name. Click connect, and then copy the kubectl command and run it against your cluster. Now we wait for our cluster to report up to Maya Online. Our cluster has connected successfully, so we'll wait a moment more for some data to populate on the dashboard. Okay, now that we have data showing up on the cluster, we are showing up on Maya Online. Let's go ahead and go over to topology on the left-hand side. And we can see what resources have been deployed in our cluster and all of the storage that's underneath it. So here you can see that we have the MySQL uh, server deployed and underneath it is volumes with three replicas.